understanding, and tribute to, an English phrase explained. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel where we make English learning easy and fun. Today, we're going to explore a very special phrase, in tribute to. This expression holds a lot of meaning, and it's used in many different contexts. So, if you've heard it before and wondered what it's all about, you're in the right place. Let's dive in and find out together. In tribute to is a phrase used to show respect, admiration, or gratitude towards someone or something. It is often used when someone is being honored for their contributions or to commemorate a significant event or person. For example, when a musician dedicates a song in tribute to a legendary artist, they are showing their respect and acknowledging the artist's influence on their work. You might use in tribute to in both formal and informal settings. In a formal setting, it could be used during a memorial service or a commemorative event. In an informal context, you might use it when describing why you're wearing a particular piece of clothing that was a favorite of a loved one who has passed away. It's a versatile phrase that helps convey a deep sense of respect and homage. Let's look at some examples to understand how to use in tribute to in sentences. The charity event was held in tribute to the founder, who dedicated her life to helping others. The artist unveiled a new piece in tribute to the resilience of people during difficult times. The school named their library in tribute to a beloved teacher who fostered a love of reading in students. This phrase can also be seen across various cultures, where tributes play a significant role in societal customs. Whether it's a statue erected in tribute to a national hero, or a festival celebrated in tribute to a historical event, this phrase helps us connect with the sentiment behind the honor. Thank you for joining us today. We hope this video has shed light on the meaningful phrase, in tribute to, and how you can use it in your daily conversations and writings. It's a beautiful way to express honor and admiration. Remember, learning a new language opens the door to not just new words, but also new ways to express our feelings and experiences. Keep practicing, and we'll see you in the next video.